obviously I, I'm embarrassed. Um, someone that is extremely, extremely private ESPN. There are a lot of people that count on Shannon to be professional at all times. I don't know American football, nor but I don't care. That apparently he's a Hall of Famer. He used to play and now he runs a football talk show. So my dude went on IG Live before boning his girlfriend and left it on by accident. And now people are talking about this accident. It's like when Paris Hilton or the Kardashian, one of them, did a similar thing. It's a marketing stunt. But before even discussing this further, let's watch the actual video. Due to the actual YouTube hypocrisy, I will not play the audio for you. But don't worry, I'll be translating it for you. Mmm, yummy. I like big bananas and cucumbers full of nutrition for my breakfast. Well, you know me, baby. I'm the romantic. You don't have to feed yourself. I will feed it to you. Now open up your mouth, baby, and let me nutrition you, baby. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh. Now, the majority of the time, the girl in the video sounds like me in the bathroom after drinking too much coffee, which is pretty much every day. It's pretty much a shit fest after my bowels explode. Now, immediately after the live ended, his manager posted on Instagram his account was hacked and it wasn't him. It was some other person with the same name and the same IG account. Throughout the whole thing, you can actually hear his phone ringing nonstop. He mentioned this in his response that people he never talked to were calling him to warn him. After he finally answered the phone call, he then he realized he was live on IG. This is what he said. I did not know IG Live. I've never been on IG Live. I've never turned IG Live on. So I don't know how it works. And so, um, all of a sudden, my other phone is going off and people are calling me FaceTime that I've never talked to a day in my life on FaceTime. And it didn't. I'm like, why are y'all calling me FaceTime? And after a while, Jamie uh, uh, Fritz, who's been my longtime marketing guy, he finally got through to me and he said, uh, Shannon, you on IG Live. I'm like, doing what? You know, I'm like, what am I on IG Live for? I ain't hit no IG Live button. He says, uh, they can hear. Right my marketing guy. So he says he doesn't know how IG Live works. He's not really familiar with the whole technology thing. That's pretty much bullshit. Bro, you did this for views. So his story is, he came home with his phone in his hand and started having pina colada. But then, bro threw his phone away and it randomly went live on IG. IG app opened itself and the button that you need to press to start recording did it by itself. Right. So how can I actually be going live right now, right? Uh -huh. Now here, if I tap live, I still won't go live accidentally, right? I would actually have to hit that button, right, and go live. So clearly, this is stage reviews. And then to sign it all up, at the beginning of his live stream, he sponsored a Viagra commercial. Dude, right. Hello, I'm Shannon Sharp, and I'm a Rose sponsor. Do you want hotter, more spontaneous sex? Rose Sparks can help. Sparks offer dual action prescription treatment that's given men stronger and harder erections. Right. So eventually he also said that it wasn't actually hacked, but it wasn't planned, right? Guys, it wasn't planned. All right, it wasn't planned at all. He said he was just being a healthy man, providing a nutritious breakfast to his girlfriend, right? It's all for views, good for him. A lot of people started following his show and his whole career basically after this episode. So if you want to become famous, start staging oopsies like this. It only helps you to get views. If you like this video, remember to subscribe and click that notification bell so you'll know when I make more videos like this. Peace.